Oh, hello, Professor Eclipse here. It's been a while since I've seen you last. August 21st, 2017th, total solar eclipse that went across the United States. It's a good day. It's a good day. Well, with all of us hanging out at home, you know, my friend the Clown Prince asked me to put a little video together for you, you know, maybe impart some wisdom or knowledge on all of you, you know, give you some education in this time where we're all hanging out at home. So I thought, oh yeah, you know, I could read some Carl Sagan or some Stephen Hawking. But then I thought, no, everybody fall asleep, you know, and I thought, oh, I could, you know, do some great sciencey stuff about, you know, how an eclipse works and all that, but no. So I thought of something really simple. I thought, I'll read Good Night Moon by Margaret Wise Brown, you know, Moons are important in eclipses. So I thought, that makes sense. Plus, instant little night-night story for your kids. So let's get to it. Good Night Moon by Margaret Wise Brown. In the great green room, there was a telephone and a red balloon and a picture of the cow jumping over the moon. And there were three little bears sitting on chairs and two little kittens and a pair of mittens and a little toy house and a young mouse and a comb and a brush and a bowl full of mush and a quiet old lady who was whispering Good night, room. Good night, moon. Good night, cow jumping over the moon. Good night, light and the red balloon. Good night, bears. Good night, chairs. Good night, kittens. And good night, mittens. Good night clocks and good night socks. Good night little house and good night mouse. Good night comb and good night brush. Good night nobody, good night mush. And good night to the old lady whispering hush. Good night, stars. Good night, air. Good night, noises everywhere. So that's Good Night Moon by Margaret Wise Brown. You know, you can't have a total solar eclipse without the moon. So that's pretty important. So take care, everybody. Remember, August 8th, 2024. The next total solar eclipse that's going to cross the United States. It's going to go from Texas up to the northeast of the United States. It's, be pretty, it's even going to be uh, more people will be in the path of the eclipse than we're in uh, 2017. should be pretty great. Be safe. Take care.